A chilly start to your Saturday morning. 41 degrees right now as you're stepping out the door. Two degrees warmer than this time yesterday. Winds are still right around five miles per hour, and you're seeing a beautiful sunrise with nice and clear conditions out there. We expect to hang on to the sunshine, but we're going to see those winds pick up quite a bit today. Gusts anywhere from 30 to 40 miles per hour, closer to 25 tomorrow, and our daytime high staying in the 60s. So the wind is going to be the main weather story. We are watching this weather system coming off the Pacific Northwest, bringing some snow to northern Nevada. And as that starts to head towards our region, it dries out but brings some extra wind. And that's what's causing even a wind advisory in some regions just around the Vegas Valley. We aren't going to reach advisory level within the valley here, but uh, through Saturday at 6 p.m. We're going to see that uh, advisory level wind. So just a heads up, if you were traveling anywhere outside of Las Vegas, you may run into very strong crosswinds and blowing dust. Wind gusts right now, right around five miles per hour, not much of a problem, but right around 10, 11 a.m. That's when I expect to start to see things picking up. And by 1 p.m., we're looking at sustained winds right around 25. Those gusts up to 40, and that includes our local mountains as well. So if you're wanting to get outside for a hike, you may want to reschedule that for another day. Tomorrow, closer to 25 miles per hour, but a breezy day ahead for the second half of your weekend as well. Temps right now across the region in the low 40s and upper 30s. North Las Vegas at 38 degrees. It is a very chilly start 37 in Pahrump this morning. Now planning out your day, you will see those temperatures warming to right around 50 degrees by 9 a.m. Low 60s through noontime and 3 p.m. staying in the low 60s. We may struggle to reach that daytime high of 64. Meanwhile, those lows tonight dropping into the mid 40s, 42 for Henderson overnight, Boulder City at 44 and you'll see uh, sub freezing conditions near state line. Tomorrow we are looking at slightly cooler conditions, but less wind and plenty of sunshine. So 7 a.m. temps in the 40s, 57 by noontime tomorrow and low 60s through the 4 p.m. hour. Now from here, we do expect a nice warm up, less wind and warmer conditions as this high pressure starts to build into our region Monday and Tuesday. Unfortunately, that is very short lived because another weather system dropping right back in midweek that brings our temps right back into the low 60s and uh, brings a couple of extra wind gusts with it. We are going to see low 70s on Tuesday. Very much looking forward to that day, uh, but we are going to see those low 60s return to the forecast as mentioned with our overnights continuing to drop into the low 40s through most of the week. Definitely going to want to head out this week. Um, it's going to be a little bit hot to start out our week, but then we are talking about a cool down in about a week. Satellite and radar right now, we can see some cloud coverage rolling through southern Nevada. Pretty quiet in Arizona right now, but that's actually going to change in the next day or so. In about 24 hours, when you look at that radar, it's going to be the opposite story. We're going to see mo moisture moving in from the south, uh, mostly hitting Arizona, but we could get a little bit of a taste here in southern Nevada. I'll have more on that in just a second. But right now, you can see live look from our Mandalay Bay camera. A little bit of that golden hour right now as our sun sets. Today we did see a high of 89 degrees, so actually cooler than that seasonal average of 92 degrees for this time of year. Uh, record 104 degrees set back in 1949, not even coming close to that. Right now temperatures have started to cool down. We're mostly in the 80s, Las Vegas at 87 degrees right now. Laughlin, you're still sitting at 93 degrees currently, but it's going to be a nice night tonight. Um, overnight lows mostly in the 60s actually. Las Vegas looking at a low of 68 degrees for tonight, so it's going to be pretty cool tonight, uh, comparatively speaking, to this past summer. Uh, heading into tomorrow, conditions are going to be pretty similar to what we felt today as far as our temperatures are concerned. So a high of 94, Las Vegas, closer look at our valley floor. We do see a lot of 80s popping up as well, so shouldn't be too bad tomorrow. But what we are tracking is those storms, like I was saying. So this is what we're possibly looking at tomorrow. Uh, we can see tomorrow right around lunchtime, really Arizona getting hit. I'm not expecting too much in Las Vegas, but uh, southern parts of our area could be seeing uh, some scattered pop up showers. Winds are actually not going to be too bad. We're going to see uh, some breezy conditions in the afternoon, uh, but those scattered showers are what we're tracking. Taking a look at the next seven days. 94 tomorrow. We do jump up to 94 on Wednesday, but then look at this by Friday, cooling into those 80s. Sunday, 70s, and it does look like that's the start of a stretch of 70s. Sounds good, Leah.